Hi everyone and welcome to another video. Excuse the fact that I have two children in the background of this video. They might be quite busy. Yeah. I usually do my food shopping online or yeah, I push, I'll go to like Asda or Tesco. I never really go to Lidl. Sometimes go to Aldi. I used to always go to Aldi, but since having two kids, I just find it really difficult to shop at Aldi. I don't know why. I think it's because of the packing at the end. But this is what I got today from Lidl and I spent 43 pounds something. I can't exactly remember. But this is everything that I got and I will go through it and show you because I've put it all in little sections. So this is like the bread bit. So I got some thick Hovis bread. We never normally get a Hovis bread. We normally get Warburton's, I think. I don't know. King's Mill. I think we get King's Mill normally and we always get white and soft and sometimes 50-50 but I always like to have thick bread because I like it better. Um, I got two packets of these mini plain tortilla wraps. I got 12 large free range eggs. This is the baking section and I needed quite a few things. So I got corn flour, granulated sugar, plain flour, strong bread flour. I love this for making... Um, pizza and bread obviously <laughs> and then fridge stuff I got milk because we're all out I got yogurt this was £1.36 and then the 500 grams of this or 500 ml was £1.39 so it's more expensive to buy a smaller one how weird is that but anyway I've got some little fromage phrase these are just the really cheap ones. Got a margarita pizza. I've never had the little one before, so we're gonna see what that's like. I also got some orange juice. And then for the freezer, I got just these two, which are the kids' favorite ice creams, Peppa Pig and um, the chocolate Paw Patrol ones. They love those. And then mini ice rings and these, there's, there's like 24 bars here, which is like, they'll last a little while, so nice little treat when they're being good and then i've never tried that little basmati rice the microwavable one before but i suppose they're all going to be quite similar so i got two of those they're 45 feet each got some cheese slices because these are just so easy to make cheese sandwiches elisa and isa love cheese sandwiches so we use these all the time and then i also got some grated mozzarella because we love pizzas and I also got this enormous block of cheese, um, 900 grams right there. <laughs> but we love mature white cheddar, so we got that one. I also picked up a few bits from the bakery section, which was this pretzel, which Issa has eaten most of. And Elisa got a pink sprinkled donut as well, so those were two extra bits that are not going to be fully shown. <laughs> Do you see why I find it so hard to film videos? From the cleaning section, I didn't really need that much. I got these biodegradable caddy liners for my bin. My, my, I've got like a little mini bin on my worktop, which I use all the time. So these are for that. And then I also got these minky flower scourers. Now I normally use the like really cheap Aldi ones, which are like 50, 60 P for loads. This was one pound for two. So I'm hoping that they're going to be good. I really, really, really like the heart ones, the heart-shaped minky ones. I'm hoping they're going to be similar. But yeah, um, they look good. Um, moving on to the fresh stuff. So I got a big panette of strawberries because we love strawberries. I got some easy peelers. I got some big bag of tomatoes, so I got some potatoes, I got some bananas, I got the mini ones because Elisa can't eat a full like big one. And then I got some lemons, I got two bags of these good sized onions, I hate small onions because they just take forever to peel. <laughs> and I got a three pack of mixed peppers, I got two avocados, these are the perfectly ripe ones. And I got a cucumber. Elisa chose this, so that's why it's a weird, weird shape. <laughs> and last but not least, I picked up some Braeburn apples. And that is everything. 
So that is everything I got from Lidl. That all came up to £43, which was quite surprising because I kind of just shoved everything that I wanted into the basket and normally it comes up to like £60, £70 when I go to like um, Tesco or Asda. So, yeah, that's everything that I got. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you want to see more of these kind of videos because they're quite easy to do, even though there's a lot of noise in the background. I do apologize. If you enjoy watching these videos, let me know and I will try to do some more. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go to an Asian shop and get some things like coriander and meat and stuff for the week. But yeah, that is everything and I will see you in my next video. Bye.